Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, based on the time you'll be watching this. So today, Know Your Leader is right in the heart of the Pearl of Africa, Kampala, Uganda, and we are here to talk to a great man. Brian Kayongo is a serial entrepreneur, visionary leader, and first class instructor with a number of businesses to his name. Stay with me, Abulatsa Imbukwa, as we have this conversation with him. Oriote Brian. Jendi, Chika. How are you doing today? I'm great. Your country is beautiful. We are so happy to be here. Thank you. Are you enjoying the sun? Quite a lot. This is home for you, so you should enjoy. It's like Kenya. The food and the hospitality is the same. So amazing. Thank you. Thank you. As we get to know you better, mind walking us through your childhood and the principles you learned then that have guided you to being who you are today. Thank you so much, Shika, for giving me this opportunity to interview me and share my life experience with people in the world. It's a blessing. Uh, I'm a Christian. I thank God for this wonderful moment for today. I thank for the support from my family, which they have given me to get where I've got today by God's grace and also by the support of my wife. You know, every time they say, when you say strong man, there's a strong woman behind them. So I thank her for supporting me and for believing me and to continue growing with her in life. To answer your question in regards, what are the principles which have helped me as a young man being groomed in life uh, from childhood? One of the principles I, I, I would say, it's uh, I was blessed to grow up with my mama. I spent so much time with her. So she taught me so much key principles of being patient and being know how to comfort others and understand the situation to handle them step by step and not to rush on decision making. Because so many young people in the world, as they're being groomed, they're quick at making quick decisions and they don't really get time to rethink of the decisions they're making in life. And me growing up with my mom gave me a principle of, of comfort of understanding how to direct others and also to get a level of becoming a leader at a young level more than other people because when your dad is not in the house you feel like you are the man in the house indirectly so that gave me a principle of taking on responsibilities and my parents starting to believe in me and giving me duties to be able to accomplish for them like for example when we built our first home i was the person who was supervising the project so that really helped me to start encouraging me to start understanding on certain principles of like being a leader on something small like that someone may say oh, how do you develop a principle of leadership in that but leading anyone in life is big it helps you to groom you to understand certain principles of how to manage different people because every person has different characters and they have different behaviors so if you are able to manage them at a certain principle of life so it, that gives you a chance of becoming a leader my parents didn't hide away from me of what they were doing so like from even when i was young my dad took me always to the bank he never used to go to the bank alone he used to go on saturday and we'd go to the bank together and that helped me as a young man to understand what to really people do in the bank it's not just a bank where people go to pick money or go to deposit money but i learned that when you go to the bank you develop relationships with banks and banks get to understand you so imagine at my age of like 10 i go to the bank the bank teller by the time they become a manager i'm already like 16 or 18 so the bank manager will rate to my life experience to be able to trust me with the loan which they cannot trust for the new stranger so these are the things which always have helped me to groom me for my childhood to become where I've got so far now. Wonderful. Thank you.